Good morning, guys. What's up? Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. It is Friday. I'm heading to meet Katie for brunch. I haven't seen her in forever, so I'm really excited to go see her. My teeth are literally killing me. Started new aligners the day before yesterday. So we are in lots of pain. But at my last orthodontist appointment, I did a whole new rescan. So um, I'll be getting like all new aligners the next time I go. So this is like my last set. So I have to wear this one for three weeks actually before I go back in. Um, yeah. Invisalign is a journey, but my teeth have already become so, so much straighter. Like, look down here. There used to be so much crowding down there. So I still have a little bit of a ways to go, but um, you know, like visibly they look pretty good. Got to my storage unit and I'm about to start packing up your orders. home now and I have been for a while actually I've just been like super focused in the zone drank a celsius so I'm blaming it on the celsius because I don't know what's in those things but whenever I have one I feel so focused like I just have the energy to focus so anyway I am working on something big that I can't talk about right now but I just got off of a zoom meeting and I'm really excited I can't wait to tell you guys about what I'm working on just something new and different. Now I'm just looking up ideas for changing out the bifold doors on my closet in my office because they're so freaking ugly and old and I hate the way they look. And I saw this idea on Pinterest to like freshen up a space. You can like a small closet, you can put drapes in front of it, like almost as if it was a window. I removed the bifold doors, which I can't believe I did that on my own. By the way, Chad is going to die. I was asking him to help me with this like multiple times. And finally I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna do it myself. And I looked it up and it was way easier than I thought it was gonna be. I am in my office right now and Chad is helping me hang up a drape rod above my closet. I'm really excited about it. I got these drapes from Home Goods and then like a rod as well and just trying to make it look a little more updated in here. Okay, we just finished putting them up, but I only bought a two pack and I measured it. I swear I measured it, but apparently I didn't measure good enough because it only covers half. Like if I stretch it out, it obviously covers both, but like it will be really, really like stretched thin. So I'm gonna buy another pack of these while I'm out. Found the exact curtains, which is perfect at Home Goods. So basically, I'm just gonna have two sets on there. It'll be fine. Just put them up. They look amazing. I definitely need to steam them because they're like really wrinkly, as you can see. But I love the way this looks so much better. It just looks way more modern without actually having to replace these super ugly bifold doors. I hate these. So we're just gonna pop those in the garage because when the day comes that we do sell our house, we will need to put those back on. Um, but yeah, I really, really like these. I'm going to steam them now. Chad's been bringing Trooper in his office whenever he's in here. And <laughs> Trooper loves it. Oh, it's mommy's little baby. It's early this morning. Chad and I decide we're going to go take Trooper for a walk. It's actually not super early. It's like eight, but like, you know, early enough. Neither one of us are actually working out today, but we thought we would go take Trooper on a walk. He's been really liking going on walks and it's really nice outside. So we're going to go for a little walk and bring Trooper with us. Hello. 
hello guys it's a bit later and i am heading right now to one of the clients who i've been doing freelance social media management for to go shoot content so i have my good camera today and i actually made her like a report because tomorrow's the last day of the month of like everything i worked on this month analytics and stuff and i'm like really proud of myself because i don't have a marketing background but just learned a lot of stuff about social media and obviously social media management just from running my business's social media. So it's a really nice little side income doing some freelance work. Um, student loans pick up next month, so I'm like, uh, it's gonna be like <laughs> really crappy having to pay on student loans again. So that's kind of why I did this, but honestly, I still don't know if it's gonna be enough for me. I'm trying to, I don't know. I just, I don't wanna sacrifice like putting money into my savings accounts and building up so that Chad and I can eventually get out of this house and get into a newer house. Having myself a Celsius, this is my favorite flavor right now, the Kiwi Guava. It's so good. I like it better than the other ones because it's not as sweet. So, highly recommend. I'm back home now, obviously. It's almost 6.30. I'm about to make dinner, but I'm just finishing up some content scheduling. I got like all of the content that I needed for the business that I'm working with and now I'm just kind of like doing captions, hashtags and scheduling out the content. I'm making stuffed peppers for dinner. So I have to cut up this onion and then we're gonna stuff them with like a red sauce mixed with onion, garlic, rice and ground beef. Super good and easy. next day it is officially the last day of March March has been a really good month for me so I'm in a good mood I'm ready to reflect on the month and I'm also gonna do a plan with me video which I'm really excited about doing because I've been saying I was gonna do it for a while but today's the day it's happening I always forget to wet my beauty blender Okay, makeup's done. I'm about to do my hair. Ignore the flickering light. One of the bulbs in the bathroom really needs to be changed, and so it's like flickering. But I want to show you guys that Ava NYC actually sent me two of their products, and it's really funny because I already have this, and I think I may have mentioned in a vlog. I love this heat protectant spray because it's like a 10 in one. It makes my hair super soft and shiny and reduces the frizz, but primarily I use it as a heat protectant. So the other things are just bonus, but um, they sent like this little duo. So it's that, and then also, they're split end mender, which is awesome because I use heat on my hair like most days, so I definitely need a split end mender, something to help with breakage. So shout out to Ava NYC. I'm going to link these in the description. And what's really cool is you can get them at Target. today and now I'm just catching up on emails and 
writing my to-do list out. I know for sure I have to go to my unit today and get some orders packed. And then I also um, am going to film that video, which I'm super excited about. So I'm trying to like plan out exactly what I want to do because I definitely want to create a mood board for April. And I'm obviously going to plan in my planner and my Google calendar and all of that stuff. <laughs> Okay, I just finished cropping all of the stickers and uploaded this sticker page because I wanted to finish this before I do my plan with me video because I wanted to use these stickers for one and then I want to be able to let you guys know where you can grab them if you like them. Um, but yeah, here they are. They look really, really good and they're going to be really nice to put into the planner. It takes some time pre-cropping all of them, but it makes it really easy because then when you go to grab a sticker, like that's all you're grabbing is the sticker. You don't have to crop or anything. Uh, the hard part is over with that. It's way later now. I am in the middle still of filming my plan with me video. It's taking longer than expected because I wanted to do a mood board and I wanted it to be really big and I totally did not uh, accurately calculate the amount of time that was going to take because when I show you guys how huge it is, like it looks super cool, but I'm just going to show you because I think um, this vlog is going to go up after that one anyway. So here is what it looks like. It is freaking massive, you guys, like just for reference that's like one of those little square things that i put up it's like huge but i love it it's so cute and inspirational and i really went out of my way to choose things that are relevant but you guys will hear more about all of that in my plan with me video good morning guys it's 7 30 a.m i'm heading to my cardiologist appointment super early this morning i just don't even know how i'm up right now like i've rolled out of bed and did my makeup while i was driving not gonna lie but let's go hopefully my heart is doing good but I'm really not going to find out too much information today it's kind of just like a follow-up and then I have to schedule my big test which is the MRI I'm back home from my cardiology appointment it went really good um I had an EKG which was normal and I have to wait for my MRI to really get any other results um so I don't have that scheduled yet because now that I have health insurance we have to wait for my health insurance to actually agree to pay it and of course they deny it because it's a huge test it's a like cardiac mri which is like several hours long and it's a specialty exam so i have to go up to uf to have it done it's a whole process and my health insurance is trying to not pay for it so now my cardiologist has to like send them more documentation so that they can understand that i need this so that's where we're at, but the heart is doing good so far. Um, everything is pretty much stable. There's no more enlargement to the right side of my heart, which is really good. If you're new here, I have pulmonic valve regurgitation. Um, I'm in the moderate to severe category, um, but yeah, it's it's good. I still haven't fully woken up yet though. Like I just like got up and left. It was a really early appointment. So now I'm just sitting here with Trooper. I should have went to the gym. That's what I was gonna do. That's why I'm in gym clothes, but then I just came home instead. <laughs> I think I'm gonna snuggle my baby. It just sounds better than going to the gym. A little bit later, I obviously showered and put makeup on. I actually got ready. Just made a coffee. The coffee is giving me life right now. I got an exciting thing in the mail that I've been waiting to come in, and it is a nail polish. We're gonna go. It is a special type of nail polish called um, a press, and it's for Gel X nails. If you're not familiar with them, they're like supposed to be a way easier way of doing nail extensions. So you guys know I've been doing my own nails forever. So I want to try out this new method. I know that I told you guys I would do a tutorial on how I had been doing my nails, but I honestly just feel like I didn't love the process for it. Um, so I did some research and discovered this method that's supposed to be a lot easier faster and then it's also something that like you don't have to do as much filing with because I feel like I would spend so much time filing and sometimes I would still have like lumps and bumps from doing the um the dip with a tip so we're gonna try this method I'm really excited I will like show you guys behind the scenes of me trying it out but like this is by no means a tutorial because this is the first time I'm ever doing it and this method is kind of interesting I already removed my nails so we're gonna do this
all finished with my nails. Here's how they turned out. I really, really like them. This was so much faster than doing dip because I didn't have to do a ton of filing. The shape is already there because it's just a full nail cover. They feel really sturdy even though they are like obviously long, but the process for putting these on was just so much easier. So I really like them. We'll see how they hold up. If they hold up well, um, then I'm honestly just gonna start doing this instead of the dip powder whenever I want tips. Just finished eating dinner. I had pasta, Chad had pizza. We just decided to order in, but I didn't want pizza. So I got spaghetti and it was delicious from this local Italian restaurant. Now I am waiting for Sarah and Jennifer to text me that they are getting on. We're all gonna play Xbox tonight. I've been like playing again. I hadn't played in so long, actually. I like, made a little setup in my office. Let me show you guys. Here's my little setup. Ignore the flashing lights. They're not really flashing like that in real life. This is just how my camera rolls, I guess. Just makes everything look like it's strobe lights. But yeah, here's my little setup. Nothing crazy, but it's a cute little setup. And the greatest part is I can hide it with my closet now. Like, I wouldn't have been able to do this before with the closet doors, like, actually have, like, a little desk set up in here, but now I can, and I love it. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm gonna end the vlog here so I can go get on with them. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button, and I'll see you in my next video.